So you're thinking about setting up an offshore company in the British Virgin Islands, BVI? Well, let's examine the pros and cons of that. So if you're thinking about setting up an offshore business, you could go with the British Virgin Islands, but of course that's just one choice. In this video, we're gonna break down lots of choices and explain to you which one may make sense for your business. So what exactly is an offshore company? Well, much like a domestic US company, it could be a limited liability company, it could be a corporation. It's essentially just a business structure that you're forming for your business, again, much like you could do in the US. Okay, so why would somebody form an offshore entity in BVI, for example? Well, there are a couple of big reasons. Like for instance, maybe you're looking for tax strategies, or how about entering a foreign market? Perhaps it's easier if you have a foreign entity than a US entity. So if you form a company in the US, there's a chance that people can find out who the owners are if they just look online. In BVI, for example, they pride themselves on privacy and anonymity. You can't just look online to find out who owns a BVI company. You might think it's difficult to set up a BVI company, but you know what? Nowadays, it's actually pretty streamlined. So yeah, there are costs in some paperwork, but it's not as laborious as you might think. So what are some risks? Well, lack of physical presence. It's gonna be challenging to operate a company in the British Virgin Islands if you're not actually in the British Virgin Islands. That of course means that if you're in the US, even with a BVI company, you're still probably operating a US trader business. Even if you're not, and you actually want to have a physical presence in the British Virgin Islands, you may find it hard to do so. If you have a BVI company, similar to a US company, you're gonna to have to have correct compliance reporting. You're gonna need financial statements. You may even have to submit certain annual reports to the local registrar or other local agency, similar to the US. We've all seen movies. There is a stigma associated with companies in BVI, for example. Historically, they've kind of been associated with money laundering and tax evasion. If that's your goal in setting up a BVI company, think again. There are some very, very big companies that have offshore companies, subsidiaries perhaps, and the reason why is that they're gonna pay lower income tax rates offshore in a non-US market versus say, the US company that has to pay a higher tax rate on its income. So the goal is to maximize offshore non-US profits while increasing US expenses to drive down US taxable income. At the end of the day though, if the money flows back to the US and is eventually distributed out the shareholders, US people are gonna to have to pay taxes on it. However, you could find lower tax rates abroad and it could provide a brief deferral strategy for taxation until you inevitably take the money out as dividends. Hey, if the British Virgin Islands just doesn't sound that great for you, well, guess what? Puerto Rico might be an option. It also has some pretty good weather and it just so happens that I have a Puerto Rico video for you. Check it out. Hey guys, if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. I'm Michael, I'll see you on the next one.